the remote rainforests of Peru recently emerged from the shadows with reports of terrifying attacks by anomalous beings that local villagers refer to as the face peelers. Witnesses describe these creatures as descending from the skies to inflict skin burns and trauma using some kind of advanced energy weapons. Are these the cold-blooded actions of illegal miners seeking to intimidate remote tribespeople, as some officials suggest? Or could there be a more profound explanation rooted in Peru's hidden extraterrestrial past? Join us as we explore the enigma of Peru's face peelers through the lens of the ancient astronaut theory. Examining the accounts and evidence reveals this may be just the latest chapter in Peru's extraordinary cosmic history. A history that has seen advanced alien civilizations influencing its people and shaping its mysterious sites for centuries. Our story begins in the remote village of Caruarazo, located deep in the Amazon rainforest of Peru's Loreto region. Seguros de que se trataba de naves espaciales, salieron de sus casas y los invadió el temor. Tenía miedo, tenía temor, pero de todas maneras era algo impresionante porque eran luces que se movían circulares y tan perfectas. Aún en shock, avisaron a los demás vecinos de la cuadra y se quedaron viendo al cielo. Captaron con sus cámaras y celulares esta otra imagen, donde se ven luces en movimiento. The indigenous people have peacefully inhabited this untamed wilderness for generations, relying on the bounty of the jungle and their deep spiritual faith to sustain their communities. But since last July, an unprecedented wave of disturbing attacks has gripped the village with fear. Terrified eyewitnesses describe being struck by searing beams of light that inflict deep burns and painful skin lesions. Claro, yo tengo 6,000 horas de vuelo, ¿no? Y es... nunca había visto algo así. Pero los virajes que hacían, ¿no? Mantenían su distancia, eran unos virajes coordinados, era una perfección de vuelo. Dicen que cuando se produjo el fenómeno, los perros comenzaron a inquietarse, probablemente por el sonido particular que salía de los supuestos ovnis. Se sentía como... era como un, una abeja. El fenómeno también se pudo ver en otros distritos al norte de la capital. La Dirección Nacional de Intereses Aeroespaciales de la Fuerza Aérea investigará el fenómeno que ha sorprendido a estos vecinos. Ellos van a entregar los videos que pudieron registrar durante las cuatro horas que duró el avistamiento. Large patches of flesh seem to have been somehow dissolved or extracted. Many have been left disfigured and traumatized. Local officials have scrambled to make sense of the situation, with some postulating illegal mining interests using advanced weaponry to terrorize remote tribespeople. But the evidence does not add up. What technology could possibly produce such horrific injuries while leaving no other trace? And why would miners target such isolated villagers with no resources to exploit? Some astronomers have noticed intensifying lights in the skies over this region. Could the attackers be extraterrestrial beings making strategic shows of force? The locals themselves trace the roots of the evil face peelers back to their ancestral legends. Their stories reference divine teachers from the stars who shared advanced knowledge with their ancestors long ago. Glowing angelic beings who traveled on shimmering sky vehicles. The cosmology of the region is interwoven with accounts of otherworldly visitors guiding humanity. The Incan Empire dominant in Peru before the arrival of the Spanish also documented contact with powerful sky gods who could appear and vanish at will. Some experts even suggest Machu Picchu and other megalithic sites may have been constructed under guidance from ancient alien architects. Clearly, Peru's history has been shaped by repeated extraterrestrial intervention. The disturbing attacks may represent the periodic testing and control measures taken by these alien overlords. Perhaps some new chapter is unfolding in this ongoing celestial experimentation in Peru's isolated rainforests, away from the eyes of the world. This region also holds remnants of lost civilizations yet to be rediscovered, some possibly with artifacts or knowledge desired by extraterrestrials. What secrets lie buried within Peru's jungles for which these ruthless beings are searching? One recent revelation may be most telling, the governor of Loreto's public statements on the existence of classified information regarding the attacks that cannot yet be disclosed. Is her administration privy to a profound truth about the nature and motives of the face peelers? A truth being suppressed to avoid worldwide panic? 
Peru may now unwittingly find itself on the front lines of a silent cosmic war. A battle raging between opposing extraterrestrial factions vying for influence over humanity's future. The innocent people of Caruarazzo and other villages seem caught in the crossfire of forces they cannot comprehend. But the locals remain resilient, drawing strength from ancestral teachings. Their rich cultural traditions may yet hold clues to defending against this extraterrestrial threat. As unlikely as it seems, the salvation for humanity against marauding cosmic forces may lie in lessons preserved from Peru's hidden past. Stay with us as our investigation continues probing this mushrooming extraterrestrial crisis threatening the remote villages of Peru. Ancient knowledge and modern ingenuity may together provide the answers we need to overcome sinister celestial powers. The next chapter is unfolding in South America's ancient heartland, where the key to humanity's future may still be written in the stars. As we explore the extraterrestrial forces possibly behind the horrific face peeler attacks in Peru, their motives point to a familiar story one that shaped humanity's beginnings according to ancient astronaut theory. The Anunnaki were powerful Mesopotamian sky gods mentioned across Babylonian, Sumerian and Akkadian tablets. But rather than mythical figures, ancient alien theorists believe they were an advanced reptilian race from the planet Nibiru that engineered humans as a slave race to mine gold. Gold extraction on a massive scale also appears in ancient South African tales of the Shatori or Anunnaki sky gods. The mysterious circular stone ruins at Adam's Calendar in Pumalanga province resemble the layout of an ancient ET-operated gold mine, according to researcher Michael Tellinger. Yeah, we didn't know that it had a head. And we came here one morning early, and we started removing the soil from here and went, oh my god, it's got a head and a beak. <laughs> so, um... so Phil Callahan's work shows that as soon as you stand the rock up, it creates a totally different field. Yes. The site dates back over 75,000 years, pointing to advanced knowledge and activities long before human civilization emerged. Are the cosmic forces in Peru continuing this long extraterrestrial obsession with extracting gold where ancient sites indicate their past earthly mining operations? Throughout Peru's history, legends reference divine beings visiting to share knowledge and spur human development. But this exchange may have been a carefully crafted distraction to hide the exploitation of human and natural resources by visiting extraterrestrials. The Incan sun god, Viracocha, echoes the Anunnaki leader, Enki, who genetically engineered early humans and imposed order. As humanity progresses, extraterrestrials seem to reassert control through violence and intimidation against indigenous cultures connected to their past intervention. As we connect these dots, a pattern emerges suggesting humanity still lives in the shadow of extraterrestrial masters who oversee their terrestrial enterprises. Peru's people and treasures attract these otherworldly forces who wish to expand their intergalactic power and wealth. But the answers to humanity's exploitation may still be unearthed within the living cultures of Peru's rainforests. Their mythology holds clues to the shocking truth. Join us next time when we delve deeper into the unknown and paranormal, only on the dark encrypt, like, share, and subscribe.